Hey guys, how's it going? So a lot of you have asked me how to install the handle on this Ozito leaf blower. To be honest, it was very tricky, so I'm going to show you guys how to do it. Okay, so step by step, we have this part here. Now this part here goes into the leaf blower. This flat section here, as you can see, goes on this side. Alright, but first we'll install this to here. So as you can see this side here has got a cutout and that's where this gets installed. So to make things easier we'll grab the little piece and this piece here, so the two single pieces, put them together. So as you can see there's a tip on here that goes like that. Okay. Then you want to grab this bit first. Now this will only go on one way. You can't make a mistake with that. So it goes on like that. Grab this bit, put that on. Make sure that sits like that. Okay. And then what you want to do is tighten up this screw here a little bit. So you need your Phillips head screwdriver. Make sure these two pieces sit together and tighten it up. Alright, so it should look like that when you're done. Okay. Now this is a tricky bit. So you've got two screws, one's longer than the other. You want to use the shorter one for this part. So that's the shorter screw, and that's the longer screw, as you can see. So get the shorter screw, line them up together, like so, and then sort of just wiggle them in. You want to start off with the little one. I found it to be a bit easier like that. So once that's in, so just like that, show you again. So wiggle it in and then you grab this piece here and you push it in. Once they're in, you grab the short screw, line it up with the hole here. You should be able to see through that hole. And then you can just tighten it up. Like so. Nice and tight. And that's that part done, so that's not coming out. Alright? Now for the next step, we line up these two together. You sometimes have to tilt it on an angle to get it started, and then it should go in. Just like so. Alright. Then you grab your long screw, put it in, and tighten it up.
So this is where the tricky bit comes. If you don't line it up properly, the screw won't go through the other end. So sometimes what you have to do is, you just wiggle it a bit, and then the screw will go in. All right, and that's it, ready to go. All that's left is the bag, which is pretty simple. You just push it in like so, like that. Tie up the rope, same like a shoelace, and that's it. All right, so that's good to go now. Also another thing, this is about one year old and it's still going strong. I don't use it every day, maybe once a month, but great value. Okay guys, good luck.